I urge you to eat at least seven different fruits and vegetables today. I've got apples, oranges, broccoli, cucumber, tomatoes, bell peppers, carrots, you name it, avocado, bacon. Breakfast is the most important food of the day, I'm telling you. And let me tell you something. If you don't eat a healthy breakfast, packed with fruits and vegetables, which are God's medicine, you can be spending your money on medication instead of spending it on a delicious breakfast. Good morning and welcome to Cora's Live. Nigerian singing, dancing princess all the way in Hollywood, California. Eating my breakfast and today is a giveaway day. This is my birth month. You guys know that today, this month is month of June. I named my daughter June for a reason. It's my month of blessings, my month of favor. It's also my month where I give away a lot of things to my fans. Today I want to give $100 to a lucky fan. Hmm? $100 is nothing for some of you. But for starving artists like us, <laughs> it is something. I want to give $100 out today. Mm. To win this hundred dollars, I want you to request to go live with me. The question will be, the question will be, list all of my songs, my discography. But I'm one of the older women that follow you because I just think you're so freaking talented. And I just love you so much. Coming to America and taking charge. That's my girl. <laughs> I love you. I do. I have every all my friends watch you. They are like, you are so funny. I said, watch Cora. So I got everybody watching you. They're like, you're so funny. I'm like, I love that girl. You know, I really do. I love you. So do you know my music? I'm sorry. Say that again. Do you know my music? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so I know you're working and you're an older woman and you don't need the money. But, <laughs> but can you can you say my discography? Because I'm giving out a hundred dollars today. Can I do what now? This up music because I'm giving out a hundred dollars today. Okay, call out your music. Mm -hmm. List them out. Akara, I, I I don't know. I just sing them. The one that you are doing outside when you're pregnant. I mean, I look at all of them. And I watch you when you record yours. I don't know the official names. I just watch them. I'm 63, Cora. Okay. What? Yes, I'm 63. How? Yes. I'm 63. I've been eating. That's why I keep licking my teeth. But yes, I'm 63 years old. I have four children and four grandchildren. So I'm not a young girl. <laughs> oh! Yes. Right. Yes, I'm 63. I'll be 64 in March of next year. Are you in the U.S.? Yes, I live in Maryland. I even invited you. I said, oh, you can come and stay with me. I live in a mansion. Um, Ooh. So spa. Yeah. And I'm like, come stay with me and let me put give give uh, go. you are my goals. Yes. You are goals. <laughs> you're, you're already there, girl. Don't let nobody tell you what you can't do. And tell, them haters don't even respond to them. Just ignore them. When you ignore them, they will hate you even more. Girl, just keep blaming them and ignore them because they are so mad that you came to America and you're doing all these wonderful things. And that's all it is. They're jealous, girl. So don't even pay them no mind. I be cracking up. Sometimes I go in on them and I say, nah, let me leave them alone. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Thank yeah. you so much. 
Yeah, you you're, look you're so beautiful. I got everybody watching you, girl. I want to be like you. I want to be like you. I want to be like you when I'm older. Oh, my God. Yes, I want to I wanna stay home and make money. Make money like you. <laughs> oh. I want to have three acres of land like you. <laughs> do it. You can do it, girl. I worked hard when I was young, when I was in my 20s, 30s, 40s, and 50s. I was chilling. You know, that's all. You make your money now while you're young. And when you get older, you can just chill out, you know? And I was also, you know, I had, excuse me, invited you because I also have a beach house on the water. And I mean, we have parties out there all the time. But I was like, I want to just get her up here and make some money. <laughs> I'm coming. I'm coming to you. I'm yeah. coming. You key me in. But I live by myself. I have six bedrooms and five full bathrooms. Bring the girls. Girl, we can have fun. I have daughters. I have two daughters. I have one daughter in Texas. She got married last year. She's a minister. And her wow. husband is a minister. And she's very successful. Her name is Natasha T. Watson. And she she lived in Tanzania on a missionary journey. She wrote a book, um, Absence of Ex Excess, which was a bestseller. My daughter is a best-selling author. So if you ever want a really great book written, she can do your whole story. But she's written so many books. She's written probably over 50, 60 books. But her name is Natasha T. Watson. Her latest um, book out is 52 Weeks of Devotion for Women. Mm. So you might want to check it out. It's on Amazon. It's in Walmart. It's in Target. But um, yeah, my daughter is very powerful. And I, you know, you sort of kind of remind me of her because you're strong and I like that. You Ooh. know, yeah. Because my daughter's 40 now. And you're what, 30? 30 years old? I will tell my age. You can Google it. Girl. <laughs> oh. You know, I just love you. You are so funny. You made me fat, too, because every time you eat, I eat. I'm like, I don't stop eating. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm not well, eating any more food. Cora's making me super fat. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. This morning has been such a blessing. You are, you are an incredible, vivacious, amazing. <laughs> I cannot even. <laughs> 63. Yes, girl. Black don't crack, and this is That's a definite. You just take care of yourself like you do. Don't worry about nobody. Let people hate. That's what they do, girl. And you just keep, okay, bless you. Keep it moving.